to the Rachel girl? Yes or no? Okay. All right, boys. Last round. Round three. Final round. Winner takes all. This is for all the Marvel guys. Uh, Heart of Yara versus none other than our boys, Creed Haas. You guys know the deal. Round one, we barely lost. Uh, round two, we sent him to a shot. You know what? Round two, actually, guys, my box alone, I believe, sent both of them to the shadow realm. And then also Yara's box it was pretty decent, also. So, anyways, guys, round three. This guy, this time, is gonna be King's Court. And as you see in the intro, Sky didn't want to do the ritual because she said I had it. You know, it's easy money, according to her. And um, again, she's right next to me, anyways. All the powers are with me. So, guys, without any further ado, let's do this. Let's send Creed, Haas, I mean, uh, Creed and Amhas to the Shadow Realm. Guys, I'm gonna leave their uh, videos, all three of them, in the description below. Go check them out, guys. Uh, let us know who won this final round because. If you subscribe and you like the videos, guys, of all four channels, I'm gonna choose two winners, okay? And I'm gonna do the same thing I did last time, where one winner is gonna get all the super rares from this side, and another winner is gonna get all the super rares from this side, okay? So let's begin. All right, so again, guys, check the description for the videos. I'm not gonna waste any time, I'm not gonna go for it. You know, I've seen a lot of people do, you know, um, videos on these guys so i know i'm pretty sure you guys know more than than i do by far actually and of course we're looking for these guys in collections rare and i'm gonna show you guys exactly what cards are you gonna be getting uh the potential winners that is you know so just so you guys know which ones exactly you're gonna get all right and and and, and you know like i say guys i don't know the prices i been so busy i haven't checked the prices i just know that the god cards collection verse are extremely expensive bro they're like over 400 bucks you know it's crazy and the ultra rares the pharaoh ultra rares, whatever you want to call it also are like over 100 bucks i don't even know how they look yet i'm i'm guessing the ultra rare but kind of different maybe i don't know i haven't been able to um you know enjoy watching oh too busy guys you know life right nothing yet here we go come on queen's knight what i guess oh this is pretty cool what do you guys think about the artwork uh okay joker straight first ultra rare you see all the queen king and the knight pretty cool Okay, what do you guys think about the artwork? You know, honestly, even though this set is extremely good, you know, it's really, really good. It's one of the best in the past. I don't know, is it the best of the year so far? I think so. But it's one of those that, for me personally, guys, I don't like the artwork that well. I mean, that much. I mean, like, I'm not surprised. Like, um, uh, what's it called? Um, Ancient Garden. The set was one of the worst, right? But yet the artwork, I loved it. You know, this is pretty cool though. I gotta say. But other than that, oh, this guy in Collector's Rare too. That'd be so awesome. So I don't know what you guys think about that. You guys agree? Disagree with me when it comes to the artwork? There you go. And again, guys, I'm pretty sure you guys seen so many openings. And this guy's. Ooh, this is pretty cool actually. Okay, and again, guys, I pull a close rare, and I think I'm gonna send these guys to the shadow room by myself. I don't know if they were kidding or not. All right, I, you know, I'll take that back. The artwork is pretty good. I don't know if uh, M Haas and, and Cree were joking or not, but I, I, according to them, they didn't pull too well. I don't know about that. Maybe it's just like a trick, just to, you know, make us think. That we got this and then they're gonna pull something like huge and they're gonna surprise us you know you know what i take that back i like the artwork but i don't think it's much as you know the other sets and then honestly bro i should have like man i should do more a little bit more uh, research on these guys i would have bought a case man 
this is one of those that actually worth buying a case because like i said bro you put one of those god cards and it's already almost you know worth almost a case that car alone here we go and i missed that you know i, I did when i pulled the collection for the first time on Genesis, on the uh, not Genesis impacts on the um, ancient garden just looking at the edge you know when you like when, when you go like this and you see that like oh man that's such a good feeling you know our second ultra burning soul i don't think it's a good one though just the name burning soul that tells me you're not expensive right there you go we still get one more ultra let's hope we get something good though if not i'm doomed oh we are doomed Come on, Solga, the Prophet. Too close. Cloud Castle. I like that one. And nothing. Oh, you know what? I forgot, bros. Hold on. Yeah, I forgot to separate them, guys. So this one winner. I'm gonna show it to you at the end of at the end of the video. What cars you're gonna win, okay? This that pile right there, one winner is gonna get that. The other winner is gonna get this pile as soon as I have it, you know, completed. I'll show you guys every single car in detail. Here we go. The Warriors Return are live. That's one of the good cards from back then. I remember using that in my Warrior type months uh, deck. Guys, also, if you don't mind, comment down below who actually played when um, the game first started. You know, back in the early 2000s. Who played? I did. And I keep hitting the camera, bro. I actually went to tournaments and stuff uh, at least three times and every single time I always win round one you know always round one was you know kind of easy always and then for the most part I won round two but I always get eliminated on the round three which I think was like it wasn't the semifinals the one before that whatever that's called that was fun though we took get one more ultra potentially a collection and an ultra <gasps> all right here we go and i think i just saw it bro i think i just saw what it is here we go bro i was thinking up i was talking about this feeling and i just saw it and i think it's reinforcement of the army and if it is yes it is just look at that beauty bro golly i don't think i've seen this in question yet those lines ah this one i had sleeve you know what hold on guys yeah, just look at that. My cool Yu-Gi-Oh! Dark, Dark Side of Dimension sleeve. Bro, we just sent it to a Shadow Realm. Guaranteed. They're done for. And what is this? Like 100 bucks? I don't know. I'll I'll pop the, the price, guys. So that means we get another Ultra Rare on top of that. How cool is that, bro? Here we go. I'm just going to... Oh, Spinkle Witch. Joker's Knife. This is a good one. I think it's like almost double digits, actually. I think it's 8 or 9 bucks, right? Look at this. Again, cool sleeve. I like this guy actually with the artwork. I'm pretty sure it's a good card. Alright guys, last pack. I'm gonna I was gonna skip it, but I'm gonna show you guys real quick. Uh we shouldn't get anything unless it's like a error box and it's not. Alright, so guys. Alright guys, so check it out. One winner is gonna get these right here. Just so you guys know, okay? I'm gonna go. Wait, that's all. That's one winner. The other winner is gonna get these cards right here. Rose Princess, uh, I like that girl. One winner is gonna get these right here, all right? Guys, remember, be subscribed, like the video, and check every, uh, every single one's video, guys. Let us know, can they, can they actually beat us, bro, with this puppy right here? Unless they pull something better, right? So, guys, and also, these two Ultras, which I'm gonna sleeve as soon as I'm done with this. Guys, thanks a lot for your support, as always. See you in the next one. Peace out.